go, let's see where he casts to. Surface Paradise, look at this guy cruising along, stand up paddle boarding, pretty popular these days. Sure, if we'll get in here, just going for the evening sun. Don't forget, folks, this is a, a, a May evening here. It's not the middle of summer, but probably like a, a, a English summer is probably more or less equivalent to our summer here. So, no wonder lots of English people like to migrate out to Australia. Although the, the cost of living would be a little bit different to what they would have been used to for, for years ago now. It's pretty expensive living in, in Western Australia. Surface catching the waves. Check this out. Oh, he's wiped out. This guy's going all the way into shore. Awesome stuff. That paddle borders a long way out. I hope there's no uh, no uh, cheeky critters out there coming in for an evening feed tonight. For his sake. We've had a we've had a few uh, well we're the shark capital of, capital of the world as as the viewers know from the previous uh, commentary that looks to me like shark bait anyway it's a clear day so you should be able to see something coming not that you'd be able to do much of it if it did. That's the rock to get off, just out there.
is either packing up already or moving up to the rocks, I'd say. Certainly, I reckon that'd be a, uh, a good spot to try fishing for as well. That that rock platform out there. Trig Island, I, I believe they call that. Stop the rocks here. Yeah. Any luck? I saw you get that little one. Those little brim, was it? Little brim. Yeah. A little rough. Oh, yeah. Exactly. I was going to say, is there a hole out there? I thought you had a sinker on. Is there a hole out there somewhere, is there? There's a whole passage going on. Yes. The waves. Yeah. Looks like a thing around. Do you come down here very often or? This time around here. Yeah. yeah. I usually go over there. That's where I'm going down. Is that what they call Trig Island over there? Is yeah, that where they is that, that's where they catch the tailor from, isn't it? Where they Yeah, but uh, you see where they got the guys heading on the outside? Yes. Just then I stand. Oh, okay. So put full suit on. Yep. Okay. okay. Got low tide. High tide now. Yeah. But just up there high. Yeah. But it's very calm today. Sure. So I always wonder, that's actually where they walk out and... Yeah, and they walk out there. And stand. It's because they're staying on the south side. You get the first pool, you get a little bit of heat going out. Yeah. Now they're cool. And that side is all reef. They're fish there in the channel more or less. So on the southern side of it. On the southern side. Yeah. Okay, but they they knew the exact right conditions, wouldn't they? Oh yes, for today you can walk out nicely. Yeah. Of course, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm a tailor fisherman myself. Yeah, I got the Calberry for them, so yeah. Calberry, Calberry. Calberry, yeah. Where you catch the tailor? Go the other side of the point and walk out on the reef behind the other behind the main Chinaman's point. We've got walk behind the reef and walk out yeah. like they do here. Yeah. Uh, We've got a 90 centimetre one a few years ago up there. It's quite big. Right. Yeah. It's about what, nine kilos. When about I reckon it was I reckon it was about six, but it was wide. Yeah, and and, and long. I reckon it was only about six. Yeah. Friend of mine caught one about six many years ago down at Cottesloe. Yeah. Eight kilos. They don't get them like that very often anymore, do they? 85 centimetres. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I must admit, I didn't weigh the one I caught. I just measured it, so I don't know, but yeah. 95? 90, yeah. 90 centimetres. Yeah. No. No, you get a lot at 50 or 60, but yeah. Yeah, 50, 60. Yeah. My biggest one, 13 and a half pounds. Yeah, that's a fair whack. 6 kilos. Do you go out yourself off the edge there or not? No, no,
Oh, we? Yeah. That, that's where you go. Yeah, exactly. Oh, that's where you caught the fish? Yeah. Yeah. That's where we used to get in. Oh, up to 18 pounds. Brilliant stuff. Yeah. You can't get in okay. You can't get in anymore. No. 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 Dry, dry. That's so dark. <laughs> the only way to eat Taylor is straight out of the ocean, straight on the pan. Oh, yeah, the, the 40 centimetre ones are best, so put the big ones back. Put the big ones back, let them... Let even 45, yeah. Yeah. But after the... Yeah, the, 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 the school tailor are the best. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Get any, any um, fingers up there? I've always fished for tailor, but I want to start fishing more for pimpies and, and mulloway, because I've, I've sort of done a lot of that tailor stuff now. Okay. So. I love it, I love it, yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I saw one caught like that in the river of all places yeah. two weeks ago. Just in the river. Yeah. Oh, you've been fishing, fishing around the up there? Yeah, I got him back a bit. Yeah. Oh, but he caught a um. Yeah, he caught a little trailer and just put it out. You know, it's perfect, yeah. perfect little trailer. Very good. Yeah. For anything. Exactly. It's natural, isn't it? You know. That is a very good fish. Yeah. Ooh. So where will you head to now? Yeah. They say also you get here uh two shorts. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I freaking you know, snorkeling out there. Yeah. Sometimes they see some. I tried a few times. Albany. Go to Albany. <laughs> Albany, I uh it's a fair drive. You know peaceful day? Yeah. Um, what do they call it? Rems I don't know. I know where Peaceful Bay is, but I don't know the actual, that part of it, yeah. Rems Funny of them. Yeah. In the first time down, what, five weeks ago? Yeah. Not even one. Really? Not even one. We used to get 20, 30 of them. Fish out. Just maybe it's a thing. I am fine. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. You Good luck. Little recipe to success. You should always ask the old timers. I'll pretty much tell you everything. I'm sitting. Nice old guy.
we're going to head out to that pier up there. Don't really think it's a pier, more of a a mole, a groin. A boat harbour. We'll check out some of the nice boats up there too, people. For any of you uh, worldwide visitors that want to come come to Perth one day, your Tillaris is a, is a must check out. So we'll head up there now and uh, and get some footage, see if they're getting any fish up there. Spot there looks pretty good to me. I reckon that would fish well at night just there. Sun setting. Mm. 